What's up guys, I'm Vern. I'm Hannah. Welcome to another edition of Poggy Boy Productions channel. So today, we're gonna plan to hit up three pizza places here in Jersey City. Now, Jersey City is small, but we're gonna narrow it down to the Heights area, which is Central Avenue. I know there's places like 440 and downtown, and you know, I know they have their own their pizza joints, but narrow it down to three places. And I'm gonna let Hannah decide which one he thinks is the best. I mean, I have my favorite already. You'll see it. Keep watching. We'll so. see. <laughs> <laughs> so keep watching, guys. All right, Hunter. How you want to do this? Burn. I want my pizza, man. All right. Here we go. Whoa. <laughs> That's some magic there, Burn. <laughs> <laughs> my so, wish has been granted. Your wish has been granted. So we only managed to go to two spots. The third spot I wanted Henry to try was Rizzo's Bakery. I featured it in a shorts video, I think, in a couple, a month or so ago. Crusty Cray, yeah, 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 yeah. Pizza is the pizza, yeah, for you and me. They have large pies. Um, but they were closed. Uh, I checked online and said it was supposed to be open. But we still had two good places to go. One is uh, Gino's, Gino's Pizzeria. Pizzeria. Yeah. And the other one is Pizza Masters. Pizza yeah. Masters. Well, just a thing. I know I heard of uh, Pizza Masters a lot from other people. You know, all over Jersey City. They was like, oh, best pizza is Pizza Master and stuff like that. I've tasted it before, but I just don't, my tongue doesn't remember how it tastes because I hardly tasted it. I've probably tasted it only once. Gino's is going to be new to me, so I'll let you know on what I think. Yep. So, mm. first, the first spot that we, we hit up was Gino's Pizzeria. like an ordinary slice okay so here is Gino's and here I'll take a one or two bites to get my tongue really prepared for it mm -hmm. thoughts tastes like ordinary pizza <laughs> mm -hmm. I mean I taste the cheese and then they put nice good amount of cheese tomato sauce seems like you know like any ordinary tomato sauce to me. Um, yeah, to me it's just like any other pizza I've tasted within my, you know, within my area and such like that. Let me take a bite. And it goes right in bite. Hmm. Oh, you're probably eating this a million times, right? Yeah, since it's in my area. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You might have to go around your area and try your pizzas. Yeah, I really only have what Vinny's and Stadium Pizza, Three Brothers, I think. Three Brothers in yeah. General Square. No, the one in Westside and Westside and yeah. So. But um, yeah, this is not bad for the pizza. I like it. Mm -hmm. This is one of the top sellers here in Central Avenue. This and Pizza Masters and Rizzo's was the newest one in the block. I'm surprised they're closed. Mm -hmm. Probably Sunday. Maybe, mm -hmm. maybe they're like Chick Fil A and they close on Sundays. Yeah. I mean, you know, tomato sauce is, you know, a little bit on the sweet side. Um, yeah, it has a tangy, I think it has a tangy taste to it. Okay. But it's good. It's good. Okay, let me go try Pizza Masters. Mm -hmm.
Pizza Master is here. Um, from what I could see, the difference, Pizza Master looks about, mm, it looks the same, but it's pizza. What do you expect? <laughs> so, now the taste test, that's where we're gonna tell. Uh, I know what the difference is, Henry. What? Price. Oh, yeah. Can you tell them how much it is? Um, Gino's is $2.50 a slice. Pizza Master's is $2.25 a slice. I'm not sure what Rizzo's was, but I think it's, um, you pay the pie, the slice itself, and then you add, you add to it if you're gonna pay for um, toppings and stuff. Let's see. Mm. Can you tell the difference? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like I said earlier, the Gino's has a, a sweeter tomato sauce. This one has a more flavorful one. Just to me. But I, I could tell the difference in terms of their um, pizza. Mm. It's good. It's good, right? Yeah. So, in my, in my opinion, if you want to, you know, you want to try to change a little bit different taste, I'll go for Pizza Masters. Tastes good. It's not as, you know, ha it doesn't have that sweet, sweeter taste of the tomato sauce like Gino's does. This one has like, you know, not too sweet, but still tomato sauce is there. And there, um, the, the, uh, the pie itself or the slice, um, it's more chewy. It, for me, it's, I like that. But I don't know what you guys like. Yeah, I feel it's a little more Heavy on the heftier too. side. Yeah. It's um, like it's packed with the, the dough, right? Mm-hmm. And I think they have, uh, uh, they have a little bit more cheese on the mm -hmm. pizza massive. Um, did you try the crust? No, no, yeah. Maybe you should try your crust. My crust. Mm -hmm. But, you know, another good reason, like Brian said, another good reason for me to try or have, buy Pizza Master is the 25 cent difference. <laughs> mm. I can mm. definitely taste the goodness in this compared to, um, not, no offense to Gino's, Gino's is good. Mm. But there's something about Pizza Masters that makes me want to buy more of the, the slice. Mm. <laughs> it's really good, guys. Yeah. Um, Pizza Masters dough has a little bit more, tiny bit of more flavor into their dough, whatever they mix into it. Gino's is good, but to me, uh, Gino's pizza, no offense to Gino's, of course, tastes like more of any ordinary other uh, pizzeria that you find. Uh, the taste, there's a you know better taste for uh, Pizza Master. No wonder people love the mm -hmm. Pizza Master. It is highly rated. Yeah. And I agree. And uh, my, my niece and nephew, I even had to buy them. I asked them, which one did you want? They said, Pizza Master right away. So <laughs> I told you that much, this is really good. Yeah. If you're ever in um, the Jersey City area, particularly the Heights, you guys got to try Pizza Master. Yeah. But Geno's is also good. I'm not going to yeah. take away anything to it. They're more old school. If you went inside, it's a typical pizza joint, right, Henry? Definitely, yeah. yeah Gino's, like Brent said, it's more of a normal pizza joint. Anywhere you go, anywhere it's a pe um, um, pizzeria. It's like something you see in Italy, right? Yeah. Like the old school big ovens and. Mm -hmm. And uh, Pizza Master, they're more. Looks like they're more concentrated to the restaurant side of things because they're a little bit more fancy. Modern. 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 modern type. Yeah, they had it renovated to look like a more of a restaurant with bricks and all that goodness. And somewhere in the back, that's when they're gonna have you know all the the pizzas and stuff. But they're more uh, a restaurant type of um, pizzeria and um, pizza master. They're bigger mm -hmm. in terms of um, their their size of their um, place. Yep, yep. Henry, are you thirsty? Definitely. All right. <laughs> <laughs> you and your damn magic today, huh? <laughs> so we got some diet coke. Of course, diet coke for me. Diet coke for me. But yeah, let's go eat, Hunter. Finish our pizza. Oh, definitely. Yeah, I'll finish Gino's. So I'll save the the best for last, as they say. <laughs> yeah. Can't go wrong with pizza, you know. Mhm. Mm mmm. Yeah. Definitely has that more. I brings on tangy, tangy and sweet at the same time. To their whatever sauce that their uh, pizza sauce they're using. And like Henry said, the dough is very like light on dough. Mm -hmm. Like, but it's good. Yeah. I heard they make good um, 
the rolls, what do you call those? With garlic nuts. Mmm. I had to make garlic nuts. I like garlic nuts. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Definitely still a good pizza, don't get me wrong. But, you know, Pizza Master is just a little bit of upside to it than Gino's. Good crust, I like it too. Nice crunch to it. Mm -hmm. Not burnt. Ah, definitely not burnt. What's up, bro? So, Henry, final score for your Gino's. Thumbs up? Gino's, a thumbs up. I'll give it about. Like an 8.7, right? Pizza Masters, I'll give it about 9, 9, 9, 9 or 9.5, close to that. No such thing as perfect pizza, because everybody has their own recipes and their way to make it. That's why I'm not giving it a 10, but it's still higher than Gino's. I'd like to see what you think is perfect pizza. I'm going to have to go to Italy for that. <laughs> <laughs> well... You know what they said where the best pizza is, right? Bruh. Where? We gotta go to Brooklyn. Oh. New York has some good pizza too. Yeah. Well, they did say that the best water there is is New York City and that's why Brooklyn pizza is the best pizza because of the water that they use to make their dough. You definitely have to go to New York. Yeah. We definitely gotta try it. We gotta um, drive up there and try it out. They yeah. have their dollar slices too. Oh, they do? Mm -hmm. New York has like those hole in the wall pizza joints with the dollar slice. No. <laughs> That's probably lo way below than that. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> you know, you're like, not going to expect much from a dollar, but. But you know, who, lo you know who loves do uh, dollar pizzas? Who? Casey Neistat. <laughs> and these dollar pizzas. Alright, so we're going to go finish our Pizza Masters. Yeah. So. Mm. I doubt you guys want to stay and watch us eat because I know you're probably getting hungry by now. So we'll end it here, right? And all I can say is, please don't forget to comment, subscribe, and hit that bell button. Ding, ding, ding to you guys. Bye. Bye.